Kenny here, welcome back to the channel. So, uh, I tried to film an episode and my microphone was off, so uh, I have a completely silent episode, which is not great. So you may have missed a few things, not really, we didn't really do much in that episode that I tried to do and didn't really get to do. Um, I do have the first bird's nest I moved to in the corner over there, and I got a feather, so and the second one I moved up here. I might have to move the other one up here too. It's looking like it's getting better results. Let's do that. So, it's very dark here. We might need to go to sleep. We'll get some um, better lighting solutions up here would be nice too. Alright, so we're going to put both of these up here. So, the goal for today's episode is I want to get a cooking pot. I want to get a hammock. And... That's it. I probably could have left that for longer. Um, oh, also, did some more storage. So, I'll just throw this stuff and then we'll put it all away. So, we've got uh, leaf storage. So, for our leaves, uh, we have plastic storage for the plastic that we pick up. We have wood storage for the wood that we pick up. Um, this storage is for the things that we make. So, things like nails. Um, clay bowls and ropes. Um, this is for the things that we collect like scrap, feathers and stone and, and actual clay clumps and stuff. Though not very organised at the moment so I'll organise that a little bit more. This is uh, the tool chest that we had before so anything that the tool goes in there. Uh, I'm getting a lot of stuff right now so great. And then as we already had before this is our food chest. I've been thinking of grabbing one of, actually let's just do it, let's grab one of these, why that's there, and we're going to put that, <clears throat> behind, so I'm thinking the cooking pot is going to go in here, I'm going to put it up here, can I put it on top of this, I could attach it to this, or here. That's kind of weird, but I can move that later. Uh, so I'm thinking this is going to be for all of the cooked food that's ready to eat, which apparently is not all that much. We kind of need to fix that. No, I don't want you. Go away. Stop. Go back in there. So that's. I mean, the placement of that's probably going to really annoy me, but we can get that going. Um, put that. Place that on there. Yeah, I think I might like to put it further back here instead. Right, uh, so we've got some vine do here. And I must put that back there. Um, so, one of the things that we're going to be working on. Uh, no, it's back there. Okay, so, um, cook pot, cooking pot. We need vine goo, metal ingots, plastic planks, and bolts. So we have all of that. Plastic, 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 plastic. Oh! There is an island in front of us that I did not notice until right now. Oh, hang on. Oh, no, we didn't notice anything else. Okay. And this is looking like a big island, which is going to spell some troubles for us. I don't think I'm ready for a big island just yet, but we're going to go for it. Drop the anchor. Grab some more stuff. Um, I'm not getting off of this boat until I have a hammock. <laughs> Seems kind of stupid, but we'll get that. We'll get it done. Where would I find the hammock? No. I need eight feathers, nails, palm leaves, and planks. I mean, it should be fine. <coughs> So I'm going to put this back here, rotate, rotate, or do I want to put it like literally behind this? That's probably going to annoy me, let's go here. I don't think we're going to expand this much further at any point. So this is the cooking spot, so we can grab our recipes and we can place them up here. Go um, so that we can see them. Stew 
group. Yeah. Like, Ooh, no. I know there's two types of fish stews. So we'll put both the fish stews over there so we can see them nice and clearly. Okay, so we can make a vegetable soup. So if we grab ourselves um, some beets and some potatoes. And then we can put some wood down, which I don't have in my inventory because I put it all away. Uh, and we can start cooking and that's going to cook us up a nice pot of stew um, and then we've got some cooked potatoes as well get them dark. we're going to need some food soon uh, what else needs fire put those on fill them all up okay and then we'll put this back in our wood bowl okay so um I'm going to take some of our wooden bowls and also while we're at it let's put away some stuff that we don't need to have in our inventory like a bolt and all of these metal ingots down. Oh. I need to keep my mind ready to have something some plastic and some wood in my inventory at all times but I'm going to not do that right now because I'm about to get off this boat and have a quick look around and see what we can see once I get my food which may take a while alright let's pick these up and put some more put some more little metal ores in there get us some decent amount of this going on put that there ok so another thing apart from the bed which may take a while is is what? What else do I want to get? A bow and arrow. So we can grab a bolt and we just need some rope and some planks, which should be fairly easy. Some planks, some rope. So we can craft us up one of those. Maybe we could craft another one if we have another bolt. That might be a good idea. Just to have some spares. Okay, so we'll put the spare one in here. <coughs> now we need some arrows. So we've got options of metal arrows, which use a lot of feathers, which you currently don't have. Uh, where's my spares? This way. <coughs> no, it's not up here anymore. Alright, so we have. Probably, and we'll definitely have enough feathers now to make the hammock or enough feathers to make 12 arrows probably the arrows is more important right now since we're currently standing on an island that has things that can kill us I need another plank and I also need water what do I think do? Ingots. Now, so we've got 12 metal arrows. We have some fine goo that can go away. That can go away. Um, the bowl is going to give us our food. Excellent. So we can have a nice little big drink of food. Um, I'm going to actually put the bowls in here. And we might as well look that up while we're at it and I'll grab some of this <clears throat> okay so there's a few things on these islands the first one and one of the main ones that we kind of need to do is we will find a lot of things that want to kill us if it's an actual large island which it, it looks kind of like a large island to me so there will be a lot of things that want to kill us particularly Flying things that drops drop rocks on our heads, which not fun, um, and warthogs, which also not really fun, and very likely to kill me. Actually, speaking of that, let's. <laughs> I'm probably gonna die here. 
But let's fill up on water. Oh, look, we're getting more feathers too. Uh, we'll fill up on water. We'll fill up on food and then we'll leave my water bottles here. Actually, no, let's not fill up on food. We can just find a food on there. Uh, we should fill up on food. Let's just grab some coconuts. They're not the greatest food source. Alright, that'll do. Alright, and we've got a little bit of spear and we've got a little bit of hook, but not much. Which at the moment is fine. Um, and then we've got only 12 arrows. Which may be a slight issue, but we'll make it work. We can go back and make more arrows once the birds have finished laying their feathers. Well, dropping their feathers, I guess. I guess birds don't lay feathers. That wouldn't make much sense. Alright, so we've got a goat, which gives milk. Some watermelons. And my question is where is the warthog? There's usually a warthog near the goats and the llamas and the other animals. Or the bird. The bird's going to be an issue because of the. Oh, I'm very nervous. Okay, there's the bird. I see the bird. And I see the warthog. So the bird's going to definitely take more than 12 arrows for me to kill. So I'm going to try and avoid that at the moment. The warthog should be fine. Hmm. Oh, this is going to be annoying. Alright, let's go try and take on the warthog. For the moment. We're probably going to get some... Um, bird drops on the head but that's okay i just gotta try and yeah so the bird's about to make it my way Ooh, yeah. so the key with the, the warthog is just Keep going sideways. Ouch. Ugh. Ugh. No. It's just stupid bird and warthog at the same time. Is that what I'm doing? Yeah. <clears throat> so it's not too bad if the, the warthog and the bird are in different areas, but when they're in the same area, it's like, what do you want me to do? possible spear. Also, a thing I hate is that when you're not on the boat, the shark still attacks the boat. So theoretically, if you stayed on the island for too long, you could just shoot the boat completely. Which is so stupid. I should have put my hammer down too. Oh well. I know I need plastic and wood now. Grab the wood that I put in here. It's not meant to be in here anyway. Okay, I'm mostly annoyed that I lost all my arrows then. That kind of annoys me. So I think we're going to have to try and deal with the stupid bird first. Which is going to be really irritating. Because that's I'm really bad at aiming. So it's going to be a slight issue. <clears throat> um, at least we put our water bottles down. We do have a bow still. So that's fine. Wait until we get more arrows. And I don't really have that much food, do I? Well, I shouldn't, actually. We do have enough stuff. Oh no, we don't. What are we missing? No, we do have enough stuff. Okay, so we're going to put down a mango, a berry, a watermelon. Oh no, where's my pineapple? I don't have any pineapples, I need to go find some pineapples. Okay. We can eventually get that going. 
on we haven't put some copper on for a while get that going all right well good news is they seem to be fairly concentrated actually you know what I should grab like an axe or something that'll do maybe my shovel too do I want a hook I'll leave that Alright, so they seem to be concentrated on that one part of the island. As I said, very annoying, but that means we can get some other stuff done. And explore the rest of the island without being bothered, hopefully, by anything. Uh, so we might be able to collect some food and some wood and stuff. See what other animals are on here, and then we can make our way and hope that that pineapple that we need, that's good. Um, and then when we have arrows, we need to go in and try and get some puffer fish. So that's going to be quite helpful to us. But not until we get some arrows, which means we need more feathers. Alright, let's try and get up here somewhere. I think it's going to be a, a situation at the moment of if you see something bad, run for it. But that's okay. Okay, this. I mean, that looks kind of like space you can go into but I don't think it is. There should be a cave somewhere on here which we can get dirt which is why I've got my shovel out but um I don't know it may not be the best idea to have it out on the boat we just got to make sure we don't die at the moment. And the mud boat's still going. Cool. Alright wait is this the same goat or is this another goat? Is there two goats on this island? Maybe it just travelled a very long distance. So I'm not seeing the bird and I'm not seeing a warthog. So good news. It kind of looks like the area that the, the bird and the warthog were. Oh, we've got some more berries too. That's nice. Definitely, I can't see the bird anywhere. Oh, hang on. How did I miss that? There's an entire area here that's got satellite dishes and food. Okay, so we've got a crate with some scrap and some bolts. That's something at least. Okay, that's, that looks like it's all that's in that particular area, but <clears throat> we can grab ourselves some mangoes and some wood and some leaves. And hopefully some mango seeds. Uh, these big islands are really good for getting wood resources and food because there's a lot of it on there. Um, but also collecting. Oh, oh, I'm thirsty. Let's, let's get a watermelon. I didn't even think to look about. Look at that. That goat scared me. Okay, so there are two goats, which is kind of annoying because I don't particularly like goats. They, they give you milk, which is not bad, but um, one of the more annoying things. Can I see the warthog from here? No. Oh, I see the bird now, though. Okay. We've got some mango trees here, some more berries. Bird usually hangs out in an area that has more stuff, like crates and stuff. Like usually, there's multiple areas. I just don't want to miss anything. Which I mean, I don't think I have. Maybe the other way. It's very dark. I might eventually just go back to our boat and sleep for a bit. 
Come on, it's not that way though. Wait, did I get that one? Oh no, the bird found me. Run, run as fast as you can. Don't let the bird catch you because it will be bad. Is that a goat? That's not a goat. I don't want the goat. I want the llama. Oh, there's probably some stuff over there, actually. Right, uh, where's my boat? Where is my boat at? Am I on the wrong side of the island for my boat now? Oh, no, there it is. Alright, let's just go down. Hopefully those uh, birds have given us some more feathers. And also the sleep. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Of course there's a shark trying to eat my boat when I wake up. That's okay. Now, I need water. Where did I put my water stuff? I think I put it in here. <clears throat> I did, but I don't actually have any water in my water bottle. Where's my water? There we go. Alright, we've got a few sips of the water. And I can go back. And we'll, of course, fill up our salt water part so that we can get that going while we're away. And I can receive the next one. I can't be bothered going upstairs. And let's put on a pineapple so we can start cooking. And Fill this up. Oh, look at all the berries we got. Sweet. Okay, and some mango. The rest can go here. So when that's finished cooking, we can grab it. And we can cook some new stuff. Grab the ingots. I'm gonna leave that for the moment. I don't want to cook anything else at the moment on the shelters. Uh, let's go check on our birds. Now we've got one feather there. Three feathers there, so we've got enough to make one arrow. I mean, six arrows really, but one arrow, I guess. Okay, metal ingots. Do we have any more feathers anywhere? No, put that away. Okay, um, put the metal ingots away. <clears throat> we'll put the bolts away. Put my hammer in there. Alright, I think I'm gonna go exploring for puffer fish. So we're gonna go up here and around again. Oh, I need food. I mean, I can't see the shark anywhere either, so that's a thing. Fill up on food a little bit. Ah, that should be fine. <clears throat> of course I jumped in right where the shark was. That's such a me thing to do. Okay, so shark typically tends to stay on that side of the island. Wherever the raft is, the shark kind of just rotates around, which is kind of nice. I should be able to go down here without much difficulties. Okay, and we've got a puffer fish. Probably more than one puffer fish actually. They seem to tend to go into groups. As I said, they seem to go into groups. Oh no, no, this is bad. Okay. Very not good. 
with the competitions following very closely behind me. And the arrows have disappeared. So I'm going to have to try and stab him before he blows up. No. Nah. Damn it. Oh, I shot too quick on that arrow. And it didn't get what I needed it to get. Oh well. Okay, so um, let's get out of the water in case another one of them appears. That's kind of likely. Uh, we did get a head, but I don't want it, so it's going in the ground. So with that, we can smelt up the explosive goo, and it will make explosive powder. And with the explosive powder, we can make a... Um, not the net launcher, but it's the thing that goes the net part, which is semi important. Right, so let's grab ourselves a fruit combot. So we need some more arrows. We we'll probably will go searching for more pufferfish. Um, oh, let's get these smelted wallets. Go. And they both got planks on them, so that's awesome. So the net launcher lets us get things like the whatchamacallits, uh, goats and llamas and chickens. So we can keep them somewhere on our boat and it will be all nice and lovely anyway. Um, so it's time to put a battery in. So it creates a net canister. Also, once we get an egg, we can make a healing salve, which will be quite helpful. Um, and then we need leather from the warthog and wool from the llama to be able to make some cool stuff like a backpack. Alright, so we can make six more arrows. So let's get that going. Um, arrows. We should probably also make another one of these. No, don't do that. Okay, so we have a metal spear, which is going to be helpful. Don't have a hook at the moment, that's fine. We've got six arrows. I probably should also leave the shovel in here until we kill up all of the things. Um, we've got one more fruit compot that we can eat. Uh, so, are these done? Ran out of planks. And I ran out of planks. Oh, actually, let's not die with six, 17 ingots in my inventory. Oh, what was I looking for? Wood. We need to be chopping down some more trees, I think. <clears throat> That's okay. You can also shoot the shark with arrows. Which is a, a handy thing to know. Um, we are probably going to need to get more food at some situation. The situation that we food is not the greatest. That it. I mean, it's not the worst either, but it's not great. Alright, so we have some explosive powder while the other one finishes cooking up. Let's go put this in our research table. Explosive powder. So we can make a net canister. Um, we'll also need to make that and that eventually. That should be fine. Alright, let's go grab us some more puffer fish. I'm just going to go to the same area again. They seem to rotate around the island. But, um, yeah. So I'll probably do... Probably be at like two or three more puffer fish around the place. Um, as I said, they usually come in pairs or threes. Uh, so that's a thing. Let's see if we can see one really quick. I usually do come around the areas with uh, a hook so we can be collecting materials while we're waiting for a puffer fish to show up. It's typically fairly safe in terms of um, the shark because he doesn't like to move around and go places, which is kind of nice. Alright, um, 
I don't want to get too close to the boat though, because if the shark sees me, he will come over here. Well, at least that's what I assume. Alright, well, I'm going to get out of the water. And I am going to end the episode here. In the next episode, we will hopefully kill off a warthog, kill off a conqueror, I think they're called, and a few more of the explosive powder dudes, the puffer fish, and then we can probably catch ourselves a goat, even though I don't particularly want to have a goat, but I mean, it gives us milk, so that's kind of semi helpful. So hopefully, we'll get all of that done in the next episode, but you'll have to wait and see. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I shall see you in the next episode. Bye bye.